All right, we're uh, starting another video, and we have here yet another spice box. Now I'm a little bit scared of this one because it says spice box genuine authentic cinnamon spice whiskey. Now that makes me think immediately of Fireball. Mm -hmm. I was just gonna say, oh, it's gonna be your favorite. When I did Fireball, <laughs> I think it was 10 years ago, 9 or 10 years ago, I, it, it was with Cindy. I think I heard this. Yeah, I, I've probably said this before. Yeah, that's fine. So uh, You're allowed. And I was tasting it. I had my Glen Karen and I was tasting it. And I said, I don't like it. And Cindy grabbed the Glen Karen out of my hand. She said, yeah, but I like it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And actually, I think you told that story like two weeks ago. Was it only two weeks ago? Yeah, I think so. I think not long ago. Since. What do you know? Not much. I know what time it is. Yeah, it's four o'clock. <laughs> four in the morning. Okay, so I'm going to look up... Liqueur, because yeah. these are liqueurs. These are at 35%. Where's the magnifying glass? Oh, dear. Oh, there it is. You tried to give it to me like three years ago, I swear. Uh, yeah, 33%. Only 33%. Oh, it's even smaller. It's even weaker. Yeah. Okay, so let's see what it says here. Uh, brands, types, nutrition facts. Recipes. Okay, so overview. Oh, okay, so uh, liqueur is an alcoholic drink composed of spirits and additional flavorings such as. Da -da -da -da. Sure. Sugar. <laughs> Fruits, herbs, and spices, often served with or. After dessert, they are typically are we here? Uh, typically heavy, sweetened, and unaged beyond a resisting period during production when necessary for their flavors to mingle. Okay, so Okay. And this is what it looks like here. Hmm. Commonly served meat over ice with coffee, in cocktails, and used in cooking. Okay. Mm -hmm. And what did it cost? I'll tell you. Spice box cinnamon, twenty-eight forty-nine. So that's about thirty dollars with all taxes and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and it's going to taste. And the reason we're doing these is because I, I had a bad month and I wasn't making a lot of money. So they're cheap. Yeah, but... You know, excuse I, me. I can't afford $200 bottles at the moment, so that's the problem. What the heck am I hanging out with you for then? What the hell? What? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> You're so silly. You can't afford $200 rolls. I'm out. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> Remember? Oh, cinnamon, right away. Right away. But I'm, I'm scared now. Why? Because I'd like to do it the same way again. <laughs> I just want to put a little bit in my rye whiskey. I don't want to have the whole thing. Oh. Cinnamon. It's okay. So you'd rather have... Well, I'll try... Let's try it both ways. Try it both ways. Yes. Is it tastes like fireball? I haven't tasted it yet. Oh wow. It just smells like whiskey. Yeah, I mean I, uh like like uh, cinnamon. Were you um a fan of those cinnamon hearts? That's exactly what it smells like. Yeah, did you like those? Yeah. I don't know. Really? I just I feel like did kids really like those? Because I didn't really like them. <laughs> I didn't really like them. <laughs> I thought they were way too, like, spicy. These are just, this smells just like cinnamon hearts taste. Yeah. 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 
Yeah. Kind of sweet, but kind of spicy, right? Spicy, yes. Oh, I'll have some water too. Oh. Very spicy. Cinnamon. I don't get anything else. But what does it say on here? Uh, what Candy, does it, Dandy. What does it say? Cinnamon, cinnamon whiskey. Whiskey a la canal. With a nod to the days of Prohibition, Spice Box was inspired by crafty Canadian bootlegger. We did this part already, right? Our cinnamon blend <laughs> combines the taste of smooth, rich rye whiskey with a kick to the kisser of cinnamon heat. Spice box cinnamon whiskey. It's a spicy situation. Product of Canada, Spice Box Whiskey, Montreal, Quebec, www.spiceboxwhiskey.com. And ingredients Canadian whiskey, water, glucose, fructose, and natural flavor. Really? Can you taste it? <laughs> all right, all right. So they add sugar to it. Liqueurs, that's like the second ingredient in, in liqueur. Can you taste it, though? Mm -hmm. That's why you should only be adding a little drop to your whiskey if you want it for a taste. <laughs> way too sweet. It is very sweet. I prefer it with some rye. Actually, use some Coca Cola. <laughs> well, let's see what I can do. No, no, that I don't, and I don't need to do that either. I have, I have my Coke over here. The big, I bet that tastes brilliant. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I see your chocolate wrapper in the garbage. <laughs> yeah. Chocolate wrapper. Um, hmm. mm. Snoop Dogg is a chocolate wrapper. Oh, that's right. We had that... Uh... <laughs> The only joke I know. Um, we had this one, the Irish. Remember we did it last time? Oh, we did? Yeah, the Kilbegan rye. Okay. So I'm going to try that. I'm going to try putting in there that rye in there. Yeah, and then how much percent is that one? I think it's about 43. It is 43. That is bizarre. It is? You put too much Coke in there? Yeah, I don't know what happened there. Okay, we try with Tastes some... Tastes like lime now. Kilbeg and rye. I try it with some Kilbeg and rye. And I, it's awfully sweet. Oh. Yeah, this one tastes like a, a lime now. Like what? A lime. A lime? With would, the Coke in well, it. Well, would you entertain the idea of you trying it? Mm, okay. Just like a sip and see what I mean. Why does it taste like a lime? <laughs> Doesn't it totally? It does taste like lime. <laughs> I don't know why. There's no lime involved. <laughs> it's the Coke. Yeah, but the, okay. But the, no, it's not. It doesn't have a lime in it. It's well, the Coke and the aspartame. So it's Coke with lime? No. Aspartame. Okay. okay. The artificial sweetener that's in there. Oh, I thought you say it's like lime. I yeah, I think so. Mm, I didn't know. That's make that the combination of the aspartame and the sugar that's in the um, 
in the spice box. Oh, okay. Makes that lime flavor, I think. Okay, I see. Now this. That's a beer and two, right? For a whiskey, tastes like lime. It's very healthy. It's better than it was. <laughs> And this is what I added to it. Kilbegan rye. Um, but it's still not... Mm. To tell you the truth... That is so bizarre. To tell you the truth, the only... Why does it take so much lime? I don't know. But you know what? I'm not a big fan of this uh, cinnamon whiskey. Or cinnamon liqueur based on whiskey of the three that we tried the only one I like is the chocolate one okay. these other two are just too sweet and yeah if I had to pick what uh, the three that we tried yeah mm, we tried again. well you don't like chocolate so no I certainly don't I'd say probably Probably this one because when I put it in this glass and it mixed up with it, it tastes like well, I can bring in like a Diet Coke lime or something. Hmm. So it tastes like. Okay. Yeah. I'm not sure. Um, how I feel about it all. <laughs> <laughs> I think that um, yeah, they should be added to whiskeys maybe instead of just drink by themselves. But on the rocks might be different. Hmm. If it was cold, like a cold liqueur, it's because they have ice wine. Yeah, but ice wine is a different thing. Sure it is, but like if they're suggesting, they're suggesting that you drink it cold over ice, it's the liqueur. Yeah. So that might, that might be different too. Well, the ice would definitely take some of the flavor away. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. So... I think we're just about concluding this experiment. <laughs> so, cheers. Oh, yes. We're saying cheers. Because it's so delicious. Oh. Food quick. <laughs> Food quick. Food quick. Food quick. Food quick. Food quick. <laughs> <laughs>